What is up guys? Welcome back for another YouTube video. So today's the day I'm finally going to be installing these winglets. I got them for my Mustang quite a while ago, but finally I have the time. I got off work early enough. Today is gorgeous out there and I'm going to go ahead and give the car a wash, do my thing on it. Then I'm going to go ahead and install these. I'll go over the installation process with you guys. It's super easy. It's held on by double-sided tape. So that's something that's not going to, you know, take a whole lot of whatever. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that, show you guys how to do it real quick. For those of you that don't know, let me show you. So these are the winglets. You know, they came like in a plastic, dull looking, you know, plastic trim. I didn't expect them to be anything more or high quality or anything, they're like 30 bucks. The goal for today is to install these with double-sided tape and hope when I get on the freeway, they don't fly off. And if they do, 30 bucks down the toilet, basically. So, till then, let me get started on washing the car, and then we'll put it on and we'll see how it looks. I'll catch you guys outside. So, with Chemical Guys, luckily, I live close to one, so I'm able to just buy all my shit there. But you have the two bucket system. Whenever you finish washing your car, instead of dumping that old, you know, wash rag or whatever into the same one that you have the soap in, if you get one that has water in it, dump it in there, dump all the dirt and everything that was on your car into this bucket and when you go to dump more soap on it it's clean still and therefore it will protect the longevity basically of your car from like all the swirls and scratches so just a little tip all right guys once you have everything I like to use a sutures washing gloss this to me works the best smells great and it's what I like to use so the car don't you hate when you wash your car and you're just like okay cool like it took me forever to do this you're like let me do it quickly so that way you know this before the sun dries it and you still get mother fucking water spots damn the trunk got it the worst too bro so then now as a car guy then you gotta fucking grab your uh, quick detailer and you just gotta like do it again. Go over the whole damn car. So that's pretty much it. I'm just gonna go inside, get the winglets ready. I'm gonna wipe it down some more and then it should be done. Once I apply those, I'm gonna let it chill out here for a little bit. And then um, once I let it chill out, then uh, I'll go ahead and put them on. And when I mean chill out, I mean let the car dry. I don't know what the hell I'm saying with chill out, but, but yeah. So let me go ahead and do that real quick, and now install the winglets and uh, show you guys how it's done. We'll go from there. All right, guys. So I'm in my house. My brother's here. He's gonna help me with it. He's just kind of hold the camera over my shoulders, kind of show you guys where the double sided tape goes. Super fucking easy. Once I do that, uh, we'll go ahead and prep it. Why do I keep doing this with my hands? What am I fucking Ricky Bobby? Anyways, so I'm going to show you guys where it goes and how it looks at the end. And we'll just wrap everything up and tarp the car. And that's it. It's time for goodbye until the next video. So let me go ahead and film this and then we'll get started. All right, guys. So obviously you want to make sure everything is cleaned. Um, 
because you're gonna put some alcohol and then you're gonna you're going to uh, obviously put the sticky tape on it. Hey guys i'm gonna go ahead and do the other side and i'm gonna meet you outside and slap it on and we'll see what the end result is so i'll catch you guys back outside all right guys so i took everything off it's ready to rock and roll let's go ahead and apply it see what happens I think that looks pretty cool. What do you think, brother? It looks nice. No, it looks really nice. All right, my guy. All right, so, so there goes that side. Sorry, my brother's horrible at filming. He's getting the gist of it. He's gonna continue to help me film. Anyways, are you getting like really close to my face, or how am I? Is it good? Good. <laughs> All right, so now on to this side. You gotta mock it up. That should be nice and cool. Sorry, I don't wanna put it on the ground. Oop. Don't let her. Alright guys, so dude, why do I have the hardest time to do this stupid shit? You know what? Go ahead and let her. Alright, so. Take this shit off. Got off. Okay, a little truth. That didn't sound good. Ugh. All right. So don't press like a wild animal like I am. Make sure it's nice and firm though. I think because I pushed this up. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, these are like 30, I think like $34 or something like that. They're cheap as hell. My goal for this car is to put canards, but canards are like two, three hundred bucks. So, thirty-four dollars to me right now sounds really good. So let's take a look back and let's see how it looks. Oh yeah, they look cool. I mean, you can kind of not tell unless you're like walking like this. That's how far they stick out. Alright guys, so that is a wrap for today's video. Let me pick up my trash. Don't litter. So that is a wrap on today's video. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you next time. Peace.